Good morning, dogs. Spirit Week, hooping for a cause, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Crash has organized another Spirit Week for next week. Monday, May 15th, is Frankfurt Gear or Blue and White. Tuesday, May 16th, is Dress Up As If You Were In Kindergarten. Wednesday, May 17th, is Neon or Tie-Dye. Thursday, May 18th, is Dress Up Like A Teacher. And Friday, May 19th, is College Gear. FHS is having its first annual Hooping For A Cause this Saturday, May 13th at 3 p.m. in Case Arena. Admission is $5. We hope to see you there. Also, don't forget to come see the Spring Music Concert next Wednesday, May 17th at 7 p.m. Tickets are only $5. Now, we'll send it over to Sports & Weather. Thanks, Addison. And what's up, dogs? The girls basketball team will be having a meeting during community on Monday, May 15th, where they will be discussing several programs for all girls planning on playing basketball next season. The football team will also be having a call-out meeting next Monday during community in Coach Byers' room. They will go over summer schedules and what to expect for this upcoming season. Last night, the Lady Hot Dogs tennis team faced off against LCC, with the final score being 0-5 as a team. This was a very tough match overall for the Hot Dogs. Although all the players got games, everyone continues to learn and grow their physical and, most importantly, mental games. They will be back in action here at home tonight at 5.30. In golf news, the Hot Dogs defeated the host Clinton Central 191-202 to Thursday afternoon at the Frankfurt Commons. Home course for both teams. Match medalists were Xavier McIntosh with 43s. This was the first match of the season with three golfers in the 40s for the Hot Dogs. Others Frankfurt scoring include senior Alex Taylor with a 47, Edwin Wayne Scott with a 48, and Jackson Ray with a 53. Recording non-counting scores were Harrison Kiger with a 48, Jackson Woods with a 49, Luke Beardsley with a 55, Caleb Compton with a 56, and Trey Stewart with a 64. Hot Dogs' next competition is the Sagamore Conference Tourney at Rocky Ridge Golf Course on Saturday, May 13th. And in track news, the track team will be having conference tonight. It will be away at Danville. Make sure you guys wish the dogs luck on day two. Lastly, shout out to Jack Michael for being a clutch player and getting his team to the next round. Anyways, that's all for sports. Hope you guys have an amazing Friday. Now to Garrick with the weather report. Thank you, Nelson, and good morning, dogs. Coming into school today, it was a humid 65 degrees, with the temperatures around lunchtime increasing around 75 degrees. But sadly, that doesn't last long because around 3 o'clock, the scattered thunderstorms will be rolling in. Let's hope this isn't true, because it is Indiana after all, so you never know. The high today is supposed to be around 78 degrees from 2 p.m. all the way up until 5 p.m., eventually dropping back off into the low 70s and high 60s, but unfortunately followed by more scattered thunderstorms. Starting the weekend off for us on Saturday, it's expected to be somewhere in the mid-60s in the morning while climbing up to the high of 79 degrees from 4 to 5 p.m., with the low sitting at around 65 degrees. And to wrap it up on Sunday, we will see a considerable cloudiness with occasional rain showers. Our high for the day will be near 70 degrees and leaning towards the night. We will see cloudy skies and become partly cloudy later in night with the low hitting 46 degrees. That's all for your weather report, dogs. Make sure to enjoy your weekend. Now, I will send it back to your amazing hosts. For lunch today, lines one and two are chicken patty, and lines three and four are breakfast bagels. A happy birthday goes out to Lauren Borgard, Perla Rodriguez, and Betsy Rojas. That's all for today's news. Make sure to like and subscribe, and have a great weekend.